fantastic. Hello. Hello everyone. How are we all? As you can tell from this background, I'm back in London. Um, I'm very fortunate to have been able to um, come home to my family um, because I was isolated. I just stayed home for two weeks and didn't leave the flat and then my brother-in-law came and got me and moved me out of my flat so I don't live in that flat anymore. Unfortunately it was gorgeous, it was so nice, like high Victorian ceilings, fireplaces, the lot, it was gorgeous but being there at this time was just pointless, like I wasn't living, I was just kind of existing in that area and it was just more, made more sense to come home. Mm. Mm. Hot bean juice make me go zoom zoom. So today I thought I'd do something funny to cheer me up, hopefully to cheer you guys up. About 10 years ago nearly, probably about nine, um, I went to the prom and I recreated my prom makeup and put it on YouTube. It's private so you won't ever see it but you'll see it in this video and I just thought we could watch it and I could do my makeup again. So I'm starting off with no makeup because I haven't worn any. Well I have, I've worn it on and off but who's actually putting a full face on these days? Honestly. So let's just bloody do it. So this uh, this is called prom makeup exclamation point smoky eye smoky golden cat eye Ooh, <laughs> let's get cracking down to it so i'm gonna have it in the corner of the video so you can see what i'm watching eyebrows why did i walk around with my eyebrows like that they are so bad. Do you know what the worst part of these eyebrows is? I'd get complimented on them every day. I'd always get girls going, I wish my eyebrows looked like that. Oh my god, your eyebrows are so nice. Like, how do I get my eyebrows to look like yours? They're fucking vile. Hello, lovely lot. So, this is a tutorial for a budget prom look. Most so awkward, so cute, bless me, I'm so young in this, I'm literally the 16. The I use are natural collection boots which are £2 each or 3 for a fiver. So yeah, keep watching if you want this for your pods. Okay, I'm ready. Hiya, oh, yeah. so obviously this is a shock from the first clip. So you need to start with obviously no makeup on and moisturise. You need to get yourself um, a shine free base. This is number seven shine free makeup base. Okay, I need a primer. Right, I don't use primer anymore. Oh, I do have a primer. My primer is the Ordinary High Adherence Silicone Primer. The other one that I had was a number seven shine free base and I remember it used to just leave white streaks all over my face. It's the worst primer in the world. Don't ever buy that thing. Um, I haven't got a clue how much it costs, but um, it does the job. So, yeah, That's because I took it from my sister. <laughs> um, Where is she putting it? Where are you putting it, Jose? On the nose, nice. I'm layering that baby on. Christ, I'm fine. Right board, what else? Shine free. Shine free. Um, free. Now yeah. I'm going to use Natural Collection Shine Away Foundation. I have this, where is it? It's not the Shine Away one. It's not the Shine Away one, but it is Natural Collection Foundation. This is going to not be my colour, but we're going to give it a go. I'm just going to put some on my hand because I don't think I use a brush, but I don't want a lot in I don't actually know. This is colour porcelain. The foundation brush. Oh, brush. Uh. Okay, she's just going for it. She's going for it. This is a bit lumpy. I haven't used it in years. This isn't the same one. <laughs> oh, this isn't. Okay, once you've got all your Wait, wait. Hang on. I'm not ready. Ah! Ew, this is not my colour. 
It's a good thing I've been out in the sun or this would look really bad. It's going to go so orange. The minute this oxidises, it's not going to look good. Where's my buffing brush? I can't live like this. I need my buffing brush. Sorry past me, but I've got to cheat a little bit. Okay. Once you've got all your foundation blended nicely, you need to take a concealer. See, I use um, the green concealer. By that somewhere. I've got that. Hang on. This is so funny how much stuff that I still use from the natural collection that I have. Same one. Green um, concealer. Collection. Where am I putting it? You can get all the natural collection stuff at Boots and it's only like £2 for each thing or three for fibre. Oh. Okay. Under here. Oh, liquid concealer. I am going to use the Collection Liquid Concealer Last Imperfection. This is my warmer one because um, I don't want to waste my nice cold one because I, I don't know when I'm going to be able to shop for makeup next. So I'm going to use my old one and I'm assuming it's under the eyes again. Let's find out. It is. Right. Okay, now after you've done that, you need to get some kind of highlighter. I've got this. Highlight in 2011. 70. Okay, sis. Actually, my sensation highlight. Oh, I have a liquid highlighter. If I can find it. <laughs> um, here she is. In all her glory, we've got the Revolution liquid highlighter in liquid starlight. Where am I putting it? Oh, goodness, <laughs> it went everywhere. It went everywhere. <laughs> Bit, bit on your cheeks. Cheeks. I mean, okay. Not sure about that, but okay. Oh, this is way more pigmented than I remember it being. But okay. She glowing. Oh. Now I'm gonna take a cream blush. This is just like a, a rosy pink one. Oh. And apply it to my cheeks. I feel like I still have that. I definitely had that until recently, but must have thrown it away before I moved. Um, but I do have this one, which is liquid blush, and it's like the same colour. So let's see why I'm putting it on the cheeks, I'm assuming. Look my pump. Come on. Okay, I'm going to use lipstick. Um, I'm just going to use a bit of Brighton Rock. Classic. My fave place in the world. A little bit of Brighton Rock on the old cheeky cheeks. You know, if it's good enough for Drew Barrymore, it's good enough for me. I've got some pressed powder. Let me get that ready. There it is. Right. Pressed powder in neutral by natural collection. And just set all of that. Oh. I forgot that this isn't pressed powder, this is just cap talcum powder. Don't come for me, okay? Times were hard, and I'm not paying six pounds, or ten pounds, however much it was, for pressed powder when I could just use talcum powder to set my makeup, because I don't even use powder that much anyway, and I'm not paying for something that I don't even fucking use. So, this is talcum powder. Say what you want. Alright, we're just gonna set. I mean, I'm pretty sure Marie Antoinette did it. You know? So good enough for me and it's like a pound for a whole bowl so and look at that not a shine was seen that day fantastic next oh nicely oh. I'm just going for it look at that I'm proper slapping it I'm like okay now it's time to start on the eyes the eyes are very cat eye so a lot of highlight and a lot of dark eyeshadow okay. so I'm going to start off with a base and I'm going to use this colour in my number 7 box thingy okay right we need like a beige let me have a look I have this palette here called Nude Chewed by The Balm Cosmetics my friend Emma gave me this 
um, it there's nothing no, there's no color in there yes cool so I think I had one that was like cross between these two these two so let's just get them together what am I doing because I did it with my finger Use my fingers for a moment, but I'm going to get brushes. So, actually, put your face down and you need to get an angle brush. Oh, wait, babes. Hang on, fucking hell. Why? I mean, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Here. Angle brush, brown eyeliner, eyeshadow. I do indeed have an angled brush. Here it is. It's got gold flecks in it. Yeah. One of those in it. And then you need to there is. explain the crease. I'm using Sophisticated from the Nude Chewed palette. Right, she's going for it. In the crease, boom. Wow, this is pigmented. Oh boy. Um, oh my god. And bring it down. Well, it's cat eyes. That makes um, sense. Yeah. That makes sense to me. Thank you, me. I hear you, sis. Oh, clean fluffy brush. You're asking, right? I mean, it's gone. I've just completely removed it from the eyeball. But okay. Oh Christ! Oh Christ! I have a black here. What's she using? Tell me. She's using a brush. Excellent. I really didn't want to do that with my finger. I've only got green on mine. Hang on. I need to wipe this blush. There's green on this blush. Brush. Ah! <laughs> okay. It's got silver flecks in it, but it doesn't matter. Black. Any black eyes. She's just like. It. She's just like. You. You're going on. She's going for it. Okay, pause. Let's go. Oh. Oh dear. Okay. I'm assuming it's into the crease kind of jobby again <gasps> oh Christ. you know what black eyeshadow scares me i used to wear a lot of it back in the day you know emo life but now it's just not oh dear god that is awful okay what's she doing is she gonna blend it what are you doing babes let me know why do my eyes look so sad Smoky. Ah! Everything's on fire and I'm having a horrible time. Some kind of gold eyeshadow. I'm using this souffle that I got from Primark about two years ago. I have this. Get on your finger. This is gold. I need for brushes. We're going in. I can't bother doing a brush for this. And you need to put it in the corner of your eye and blend it into the dark eyeshadow. That looks disgusting. That is disgusting. No. There. Scorse then. Now once you've done that you need to get a clean round brush. No. And no. now I'm going to take a shimmery cream colour. What am I talking about? Cream round one. brush. And pat that over the gold eyeshadow to set it. No. Now, this is disgusting. Let's take a pointed, like I've never hated it more. I think this is a lip brush, but whatever. Pointy brush. And just go use back this one. Black again. Black again. And take it right into your crease and around under to your eye. More black. Are we surprised? It can't even be saved. What is this? Okay, it does carry on, but it's just fine. I'll listen. This is Natural Collection Lash Build Mascara in black. There is no way you can save this. It's actually like lace the mascara. Right, I can do mascara. That's something I can't mess up. There's literally, I don't think anyone's looked at this tutorial and thought, I'm going to do that. <laughs> but me, now, in present day, looked at it and thought, that looks fun. Let's try and do that. Lightly. And then you need eyelashes. These are 
lashes okay what lashes do i have let's have a look i don't think i have any all oh, these kind of for cow eye these are cow eye yeah let's, let's wear these right pretty sure i got these from poundland poundland did great eyelashes but this is look at those bad boys panned i'm so reliant on half lashes now that when i put a full one on it genuinely irks me i'm irked the eyelashes I've put on in this video are actually some of my favourite false eyelashes I've ever owned and I re-wore them hundreds of times um, and I can't find them anymore. They were just such good eyelashes, they were literally like 99p from Savers and the shape of them just made my eyes so cute but I can't find them anymore, they don't make them. <laughs> I look like Cleopatra smoked crack, you know? Well, that looks like trash. I don't think my gold is gold enough. I have a contingency. I'm just joking, but, but what if I did? Hi, thanks for checking in. I'm still a piece of garbage. Should I try and put some gold in the corner? <gasps> I regret it. I regret it. Uh Oh god, we're on the brows, okay. Let me just mentally prepare myself. Do you know what these eyebrows need? Absolutely nothing, because they're fantastic. You can still see where they've suffered from me plucking them like this all those years ago. I'm going to fill them in with this Miss Sporty, I think it's eyeliner, but I use it as eyebrow pencil, so. It's brown though. Right. How do we feel about that, lads? Oh, I've broken it. Okay. Well. We're going to have half finished eyebrows because I can't be fucked. You need to make yourself bronze, so I'm going to use Natural Collection Bronzing Pearls. A classic. In I used to shag these when I was in school. Absolutely amazing bronzing powder. Yes, I was orange, that was the point. I have Hula, but I also have Gold Rush by Benefit and Rocketeur by Benefit, and these have like gold flecks, so I'm going to use Gold Flush, Gold Rush and Hula together to make this little cheeky look that I'm going for <gasps> oh my god I'm having flashbacks to when I was like 15 and this is how I'd wear my makeup yes what's my pin it chin wait babes I put it on my chin as well chin <sighs> nose cheeks these are all the places I'd put my highlight I remember I used to put so much on this bit of my nose I still do it now though I put blush in there because it's the e-girl look. I was an e-girl before it was cool. Right, okay, it's gonna have to be this. This is a highlight by Emmy Way called Radiant Cashmere. Where are we putting it, honey? Oh, we're point. actually highlighting. I didn't think highlighting was a thing back then, uh, but it is. Apparently it is. It's not coming out. Wearing Apple Blossom by Natural Collection. Another OG Natural Collection item that I don't have and I'm so upset about. Right, now we're putting gold over the top mm, because apparently that's stuff. what it all needs. More gold! Just got me gold member. Let me just pack over a ban some um some heavier eyeshadow because I just don't feel like it's doing it. It's not doing it for me, sis. Now that's more like it, am I right? There's nothing I can say to save this. It's disgusting, it's terrible, and it's so 2011. Okay, so this is my final prom look. Um. Uh, I give up. This is the end of this. I cannot wait to scrape this off my face. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching. And I really hope this made you laugh because quite frankly... You know what I'm saying?